Good morning, guys. Good morning. Woohoo! It's a beautiful morning. As you can see, it is dumping down our, I don't know what to call it, wagon is packed. Uh, we have actually a quite nice place here for the skis. Look at this, fully loaded with skis. One, two, three, four up here, a couple of more down there. Woo! We are so exciting, it's gonna be a great day. So let's pump it! Epic skis! watching one of those uh, Swedish uh, television series the other day and then they were trying to define the word happiness. What is happiness? Are you happy? I will define it for you. Happiness is actually this. I mean, we came in yesterday, we get this amazing rental car, the nine-seater, we pack it full of skis, then we went to our hotel it's not really a hotel we are kind of uh, renting a house from an Italian man and we didn't have so much expectations but it was so great three rooms nice kitchen and it was actually kind of uh, renovated very lately so it was really really good and also he was really nice that is also happiness to come to such a place and you get you just get the feels for it I mean it's like it's not like going into a hotel where people will tell you what to do this is totally nice happiness is also of course to be traveling with all these people in this um, let's call it car and I think I am happiness because I mean you cannot really be more happy than I am because I actually have the opportunity to spend the time with the best people in the world and also these best people in the world they also share my interest we are going skiing all together in a nice freaking place that is happiness to me that you have understood in the uh, Aosta Valley in um, a town called Gresoni and um, it's actually three different uh, skiing resorts Gresoni in the middle and then we have Champoluk to the left and then we have Alanya to the right so there's one really big uh, lift system here that connects all these three villages so yeah, spectacular off-piste skiing, that's for sure. Woohoo! Cold air! Jesus Christ! Look at the place! Woo! We are now in the gondola of Gresoni on the way to the Punta Indran top, 3270 meters for a brilliant off piste run. Um, let's see if the lift is open. I think so. Uh, look at the place. I mean, look at it. It is spectacular, that's for sure. So we're 
now waiting for the top lift at Punta Indren. This is the one that goes up to 3,300 meters. Uh, we think it is a big one that goes up there. And I mean, look at the place. Look at the runs we have behind this here. Woo! It's really nice. Cool. What do you call this skiing? Six skiing. Six skiing. Woohoo! I don't feel I have one. I wanna forget you. But only time So you didn't bring your rope, or? No. So this is the end point. <laughs> Unfortunately. We kind of need to climb back, I guess. Yeah. Kinda. We are totally screwed. So now we need to go all the way up to the top there without the skins. But that's the life of an adventure, I guess. We're going in here. Is that? He's lost, but I 
Finally, we found some safe ground. Uh, safe and safe, I don't know. We were kind of sliding down this hill here. But at least now we have other people which are in the same area. So, let's go for the last part. Yeah. <laughs> You said that you want to do some off piece skiing. <laughs> you changed your mind or? What is happening now, Alice? <laughs> so, we're sitting in uh, a... Uh, yeah, at the restaurant, as you can see. We're getting food and uh, we're actually waiting for William and Robert to get here. Nice. Okay, Alice, what are you eating? Toast. Alexander, you're eating French fry with chopsticks. And hot dog. Pizza. And hot dog. Good morning. Good morning. What have you done? I have actually placed my skis in the ski garage. Yes. And the key should be by the washing machine. To the ski garage that is. I think it is on the toilet. Or, ah, that washing machine. Oh, look. I see. Big key. First day in Greshny, skiing. We took the car, went there. It took like 30 minutes or something. Uh, we went to the top. It was, how much was it? 2,850 meters, something like this. 2,970 meters. 2,970 meters. <laughs> it was pretty high. Okay. Uh, we took a warm-up round and then William and I went for a... Um, off piss track, so we took the top lift up to 3,300 meters. And um, actually, I've done quite a lot of preparations. So I read about the different off piss tracks that you can do, and I actually knew that there was actually one of the tracks that you need to have ropes, so you have to, so to say, um, climb down with the ropes. And unfortunately, we ended up in that track, so we need to go back and we spent quite a lot of time on that one but we came down safely four hours later 
Um, before this, um, I thought that the only reason for having skins was that you skin somewhere and then you go down. But now I realize that you can actually end up in a situation where you come to a place, but it's not possible to go down. And then you need to take the skins to go back up. So we need to buy skins. Um, then you guys found a really good restaurant, right? With a really nice Italian... I mean, obviously he's Italian yes. because he, he lives in Italy, but... Pizzas and toast and whatever for like nothing and it was really, really good. It was good, wasn't it? Um, we had some lunch, a couple of more rounds and then we went back here and of course first skiing day, so... We are having tacos right now. We are pretty exhausted for the day, so tomorrow we go to Champlok for some more ski. No. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs>